Hi there, my name is Sarah Tipman. I'm a specialist women's health physiotherapist, work at the Homerton University Hospital in East London. I've just been asked to give some of my thoughts and relate some of my ideas about the um, publishing process. I completed my Contents of Physiotherapist module at Bradford in 2013. Um, and I was approached by TC the following, after we've completed our studies, asking if I'd like to have one of my pieces of work published in the APGP journal which was exciting at the time, but a little bit daunting because it's not something I have much experience in. I haven't published any work before. So I think one thing is you're really well supported, um, especially if you're obviously doing your studies and you're involved at Bradford University, you've got access to some fantastic mentors and TC was really, really helpful in just perfecting my writing style and making sure the journal article was as good as it could be. I always had really good support from the PAGP journal editing team um, who helped again just with the style and presentation and getting it ready for publishing. Um, I think there was a bit of time, you had to put some of your own time in, um, again just liaising with people and making the necessary changes, um, but that's just hours here and there, maybe after work and, and at the weekends, but it's not a huge amount of, of time, it wasn't particularly onerous, um, and the process took about three months um, in all. One thing I would say is once it's done and it's published, it's amazing to see your own name on an article. So you read lots of articles and lots of research, but to see your own name there is quite a proud thing to, to look at and show your friends and family and colleagues. So um, as a reward thing and then something to, to have at the end of it, that was really, really um, nice to see. From actually doing the um, research and having it presented, it's been highlighted within my trust itself. So I presented um, my findings to the wider physiotherapy division. We have monthly meetings and I presented my findings to my colleagues from all different areas of physiotherapy, not just women's health, um, which was, yeah, which is great from a evidence sharing, evidence based sharing perspective. Um, my plans are to make this into a poster and just display it in the department again, just to highlight um, our team for patients and um, other professionals to see. Um, and I'm also uh, presenting this at our research and development day at work. We have a day whereby all professions present throughout the trust. Um, so post presentation uh, and just to discuss my findings is, is the plan. So I think it's not only um, the work that you do putting into practice, but also then taking it forwards and being able to share it with, um, with other professions and within physiotherapy itself. So I would say don't be put off by the thought of publishing, there's really good support available um, and it's really exciting to be part of research for our specialism within physiotherapy as well. So um, good luck, thank you.